Of all the machines that we test here at Motor Week, compact sports cars like this Mazda Miata are certainly the most fun. Granted, they're not very practical, but who cares? And what worked for the sports car crowd also works for the seafaring set. Only their small open air playthings are called personal watercraft. One of the best of these seagoing sports cars wears the name Tiger Shark. But are they really as fearsome as their name implies? Like high-performance cars and motorcycles before them, personal watercraft have recently received their share of negative publicity. This despite their skyrocketing popularity, which has seen large numbers of motorcycle dealers add these compact cruisers to their showrooms. So we headed for the water with two of Tiger Shark's most popular models to find out the truth of the matter. At the top of the Tiger Shark range sits the sports car of the family, the Daytona 1000. This sleek red Speedster's lines are as striking as a Lamborghini and positively shout performance, which is delivered by a 999cc three-cylinder two-stroke engine that makes 115 horsepower and drives a high-capacity water jet propulsion system. Handling equipment includes a quick-turning multi-angle hull and electrically powered variable trim system, which is all boat talk for this baby handles. While clearly aimed at the more experienced rider, it surprised our amateur crew with its user-friendly character. The closest automotive equivalent would be, say, the Chevrolet Corvette. Fast and furious in the hands of an expert, but still forgiving enough for the daily driver. And with a price of only $7,599, it's a lot cheaper than a vet. For those new boaters that drive something a bit more sedate, Tiger Shark builds machines like the Monte Carlo 770. Longer, wider, and taller than the Daytona, the Monte Carlo is aimed at the family boater, and it offers a huge three-person seat for effortless passenger hauling, rear-view mirrors, and a reverse drive mechanism that's so simple it's ingenious. Power comes from a 768cc two-stroke twin that makes 90 horsepower which when coupled with the wide, ultra-stable hull, produced a machine that inspired confidence in even the most inexperienced rider, while still offering plenty of zip for the enthusiast. It's more a sports sedan like the Nissan Maxima SE, fun but still most practical. And at $6,199, within the recreational means of many families. But whether you're married or single, novice or expert, safety is an essential part of watercraft operation. That's why every Tiger Shark model has an ignition cutoff switch, which is connected to the rider's wrist. So if you fall off, your boat doesn't continue on without you or over you. The folks at Tiger Shark also reminded us that you never pilot a watercraft without the proper safety equipment, including a Coast Guard approved life jacket. And that jet powered watercraft can only steer when under power. Remember, boats don't have brakes. You should also never drink and drive on water or land. Read and understand your owner's manual, obey all local boating laws, and always ride within your own abilities. We followed these simple rules and found that even with our limited experience, Tiger Shark watercraft are fun, exhilarating, and safe. As with all high-performance vehicles, a little common sense goes a long way. And while we're not yet ready to give up the thrills of four wheels and big V8s, we've enjoyed dipping our toes into the world of Tiger Shark personal watercraft. The name may say man-eater, but trust us, this is one very friendly fish.